come join us tasting the Chivat Regal 18 year old blended Scotch whiskey. Hi, I'm Jo. This is Maximo. We are Tipples and Treats. We've got a, a blue box here. And what's this one then? A, a deep blue box. Mm -hmm. Almost royal blue, isn't it? Mm, I'd call it navy blue. Mm. It is a Chivas Regal, 18-year-old, mm. blended Scotch Is this whiskey. an auction purchase? No, Joe. this is a Maximo purchase. You bought it yourself? I did. Your own treat? Yes, I think it was around about my birthday or Father's Day last year, so... You treated yourself? I did. Mm. It's taken a while to open it and to review it, but here we are. So the recommended retail price for this is around about 105 Australian dollars. I bought this on special for about 80. Mm, so it's yeah, about $25 oh. off. There's the receipt. There's a receipt. It's orange on the inside, interesting. There you go. Nice box. Nice box. Now this is 40% alcohol mm -hmm. and it's a 700 ml bottle. Mm -hmm. It's won a few gold medals. More recently, 2019, the Ish International Spirits Challenge, double gold, and 2020, a gold. So a couple of recent gold medals. This was first produced in 1997. So it's a relatively recent addition to the Chivas Regal line. Mm -hmm. it takes a long time to mature though, 18 years. It does. And that's probably, unless mm -hmm. there's added colour, mm -hmm. uh, that's probably why it's quite a rich, intense colour. That ageing in those barrels. Yes, wood. Hmm, a little satisfying pop. Mm. Shall you do the honours? Oh, nice glug and a bit of a mess. Yep, that's me. Occupational hazard, isn't it? That's my style. Mmm. Mm. Quite um, fruity. fruity, spicy, yep. cinnamony. Definitely. Maybe yeah. sort of uh, raisin, raisin type. Yeah, I don't know isn't what, it? what the fruit is, but uh, the initial nose is quite. Fruity. Pleasant. Yes. 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 Fruity, fruity. Hmm. I, I, like our my recent review, I think this is going to be a sweet. Mm. The, the nose is sort of the sweetness, isn't it? We'll see. I'm going Shall we? Sweet, uh, buttery, sweet, fruity, with a hint of spice. It's smoky to me. A, a little bit. There's a hint of smoke, oh, I think. Uh, there definitely is. I'm, I'm not so keen on that smoky taste. And so when I... Feel it, taste it. It seems to be quite strong for me, whereas it might not be so strong for you. It was. Um, I like this. It's rich, intense. I thought I was really going to love it from the smell. Yeah. But the smoky bit is. Uh, Putting you off yeah. slightly. So the uh, the notes that go with this say that it's a cask finish, and only the finest cask, casks out of thousands. Uh, within the Scottish Scottish hills are used for this award-winning blend. Mm -hmm. The nose is rich, indulgent and multi-layered aromas with hints of dried fruits, buttery, toffee and dark chocolate. Mm. I don't know about the chocolate, but mm. I think, you know, dried fruits, I, I said sort yeah. of raisins and... It's, it's, it's initially yeah. fruity. The palate, um, velvety dark chocolate palate yields to elegant floral notes and a wisp of sweet, mellow smokiness. So you pick the smokiness. I, I think it's yep. barely perceptible. It's um, There's just the ever so slight hint of 
smokiness. Would that be because you are drinking more? I, I think I'm... Smoky, or is the term peated? Pe well, peated, peated or smoky, smoky. it's, uh, it's um... probably interchangeable. Look, I, I think so, and I think I'm, as I'm drinking more scotch, I think I'm, I'm being attracted to the... Uh, richer, uh, more intense mm -hmm. flavours. And I think sm smokiness or, or peat mm -hmm. um, is, is probably part of that. So mm -hmm. yes, I'd agree with you that, that I don't know whether my palate is being refined or, you know, I, I think that's a common journey amongst... And, and mine is not. Uh, no. <laughs> or whiskey. I, th I think it's a common journey amongst um, scotch drinkers to start on the sort of the lighter, uh, sweeter, yes. more mellow yeah. scotches and sort of slowly moving to perhaps the older, richer, deeper, Maybe. more intense yeah. um, I, I, I'm scotches. Drawn, I'm drawn to taking sips of it to try and analyse it a bit mm. more. But I think we need to drag the ice in. And, uh, and lastly, the, the, they say the finish is warm, long. I think it is quite warm and long. It's, it's not very uh, peppery, is it? It's, it's quite mild in terms of finish. Mm. Long but mild. Mm -hmm. You saved some for the ice. Mm. I really like that. Mm. Neat. Mm. Let's see what the ice will do. Or oh, technical dear. failure. Do you want another one? I think um, on the, the neat tasting, it would probably rank in the middle of the scotches that I've tasted. Well, middle. I'd, I'd mm. say this would rank quite highly. Well, I th that's I think. no surprise to hear you say that because you're more tuned into the peak. Yeah, I think the um, there's a couple of really nice ones behind me. The the Hazelwood 21 and also the Aberfeldy 18 and, and even the Lord, Lord is 15 year old. I'd put on a similar level of, of really nice and I like it. So you've had it with ice? Yeah, I think that um, makes it a little bit more fruity actually. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. It's some of the soluble oils are released, and I think some of the, yep. the fruitiness has been come out, released. Come out a bit, yep. Now, I'm not sure that um, our palates have been sort of coated with a smokiness, but I can't taste the, the smokiness as much. Well, that's the thing. When you are drinking these high content alcohols, you take a sip and it sort of coats your mouth, doesn't it? And so often the second and third sip, when you're drinking it, you know, quite neat or with ice, it does tend to change with each little sip you take. It's actually really, really smooth, mm. nicely balanced. It is smooth. It is. It is smooth, um, yes. I think the smokiness has gone out. I, I can still taste just a yeah. touch of it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but f for my book, this is a superb mm -hmm. blended Scotch whiskey. That's good that you like it. It's very good. Yes. Mmm. It's very nice. <laughs> I, I get that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So that's another one that we can uh, put on the top shelf mm -hmm. of the special uh, special spirits that we have. Mm -hmm. Now I do hope you've liked this video, viewers. If so, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. And until our next review. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers.